Hello and welcome to Jock Sports. I'm your host, Joey Lawrence. We're here at Sewilo Golf Course at Casino del Sol for the Arizona Collegiate, where 14 Division I teams are battling for the trophy. Have some fun and let's see who takes it home. It's a cold Arizona January morning to begin our final round highlight show of the 2014 Arizona Intercollegiate. We're going to start out on hole number 18, a 390 yard par 4, with Graham Lawyer's second shot. Graham is from George Washington University. Over the water, over the pin, stops about 20 feet by. Good shot. Also on number 18, we've got Sam Gillis. The second shot came up short, third from the front of the green. Puts it about 12 feet by. Moving over to hole 11, a very long 504 yard par four. Byron Metha Pacific. It's third shot from off the green. Nearly goes in the hole, rolls about one foot by. He'll have that for a nice par. Now in the par three 13th hole, 242 yards, Kyle De Silva from Cal State Fullerton hitting his tee shot. On the green, just couldn't stop, rolls about 10 feet off. In the trap, same hole, Chris Kap Kapchak, James Madison, good trap shot, rolls just by the hole, he'll have an easy tap in for puck. Staying on hole number three, Connor Kornberg from Oregon State. Can you hear me? Hits his tee shot about 15 feet left. Prescott Mann from Texas of El Paso's tee shot. Preston is from Horizon High School up in the Phoenix area. Hits his also about 15 feet left. Out of the trap from Pacific, S.J. May. Good shot, goes about 10 feet by. His playing partner, Joseph Abella from New Mexico, has a long 25-foot birdie putt. And he sinks it. Great birdie. S.J. Mang's going to try to save par. He had this sand shot about 12 feet by. This will be a great sand save if he makes it. No problem for SJ. Now also from Horizon High School, Matt Lee now playing for, for Pacific. Coach Larry Boyles of Horizon High School's got two players competing in the D1 level. Gorgeous yeah. shot. Stops about six feet away. Now David Fink from Oregon State has a 20-foot birdie putt on number three. He's going to take a good look at this. Not a problem. Moving over to hole 16, a short 328 yard par four. We've got Brendan Redfern from University of Arizona. Hit a long drive, this is his second shot. Brendan had a 73-76 in his first two rounds. Puts it about 20 feet past the pin. He'll have that for birdie. This is Brendan's birdie putt. A 
left it a little short be a tap in par also hole 16 second shot Victor Perez from New Mexico a lot of backspin sucks back to about six feet from the pin hole number 16 second shot Alex McMahon University of Arizona Excellent shot. Now from the University of California, Joel Slaughter. This is third shot. It's a chip close to the green. Puts it up there close. Tap that in for par. Here's Victor Perez's birdie putt. And he rolls it in. Now from Cal. Joel is going to try to knock in his par putt. He had a 71-73 the first two rounds. Not a problem. On hole 18, Alex McMahon, University of Arizona, his second shot from about 150 yards. Alex had 74-73 his first two rounds. It's at about 25 feet left. Next up is Eric Oha, also from the University of Arizona. Second shot from about 140 yards. U of A was in fourth place after the first two rounds. The word is out, they're playing very well today. Moving up the leaderboard. Now this is Colton Lapa, also a local product. Went to Red Mountain High School in Mesa. Colton shot a 71-69 and he was in third place. He had a chance to birdie this hole for the win. He went for it. Three inches more, it would have been next to the hole, but it went deep in a trap. He Get out of the trap to this point has this long putt to tie for the lead. Leaves it a little short. But he had a great tournament. He's going to tap in here. This will conclude our on course highlights for today. We're going to move over to Casino del Sol for the awards presentation. I want to take this opportunity. Thank you for logging into Jack Sports to see our first Division I golf coverage of the year and several more coming up.
um, our 2014 Arizona Intercollegiate Champions, the California Bears, coached by Coach Steve Desimo and Walter Chun to come up. Um, a score of one over this week. You guys played terrific golf, and uh, you've got a great team, and uh, certainly appreciate you coming over, and uh, wish you the best going forward this spring. So, great playing, guys. Come on up and accept the trophy. We had an awesome time out here today. Thank you to University of Arizona for hosting a great tournament. And special congratulations to winning team University of California. Log on to Jock Sports for more D1 golf coverage coming soon.